guys welcome back to my channel and today I'm in Sharjah it's one of the Emirates in the UAE and I'm gonna show you top five places you should visit even if you are on a budget so let's start this Emirate is not that popular as Dubai but it's growing very fast it has a lot of things to offer and it takes only 30 minutes by car to get here from Dubai the first place you should visit is Al Majas waterfront. It's a beautiful green destination. You can come here just for a walk, sit on the grass, you can try mini golf, your kids can spend time at splash playground area, and then you can have lunch or dinner at one of the waterfront restaurants. Also, you can rent a bike and go for a ride. It's a great way to explore the city. The place number two is Al Khalid Lagoon. It's an artificial lake right next to Al Majas waterfront in the center of Sharjah. Uh, after 6.30 p.m. they have a beautiful fountain light and music show. And if you want to have a special experience, you can take this Umbra boat ride and watch the show inside the lake. The next place is a tropical paradise in Sharjah, so let me show it to you. This is one of my favorite places in Sharjah and it's called Nur Island. If you want to explore the island by yourself, it will cost you 55 dirhams, plus you will have one meal at the cafe. And then if you want to enter the butterfly house, uh, you need to pay extra 15 dirhams. You can't access the island by car, only through the pedestrian bridge. The concept of this island is to create a peaceful and green heaven for visitors. Here is a nice playground area for kids. It's also included so the kids can come here and have some fun. This facility makes this island entirely family friendly where everyone will find something to do. Another interesting spot on this island is a literature pavilion. It's so quiet and peaceful here. Now we're gonna have our lunch. Let's see what they have here. And uh, the lunch is included in our tickets. Just choose two food and two foods and two drinks and that selection. Nur Cafe has healthy selection of snacks and beverages and they taste really good. This is one of the highlights of the Nur Island and it's called Butterfly House, home to more than 500 butterflies. This place is located inside the structure that retains humidity and allows natural light to enter the butterfly house. The place number four is Heritage Museum. It's one of the four or five museums located in the heart of Sharjah. If you want to know more about the local culture, you should visit this place. There you can learn more about the rich culture of Emirati people and Sharjah residents over the past decades. The museum has a number of galleries in different rooms covering aspects such as livelihood, leisure, celebrations and traditions. The museum is very informative and you can feel how the weather, location and religion influence the people and their way of life. And the place number five is Calligraphy Museum. Sharjah Calligraphy Museum is the only museum in the Arab world devoted entirely to calligraphy. The museum has a hall and a few small galleries showing examples of Islamic calligraphy in different scripts.
On our way back we had a complimentary Arabic coffee with some dates. So guys, these are five places I recommend you to visit in Sharjah. When you come here, check them out and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!